honestly be better. Tatum and and everybody got it. Fine, bro. Do they? Yeah, they're fine. If they all play it in it, then they're. We see Ant when he going out there, we going crazy, bro. Champs, Ant was there last year, and the niggas took that not, L. He not the same. He probably and Wimby, is. He's oh, gonna, but that's the other part. Wimby, that's the other part of all this. Wimby's gonna be like twenty three years old at that point. Twenty four. Wimby gonna be. I think that's the time. You got at least three. We got three Olympics with Wimby. Like after this one. No, no. We got people, bro. Y'all are overlooking our people. We got Joel. I don't think he's doing it again. We got. I don't, I don't uh, want him to do it again. Give me Chase. Chet. Give me Chet ah. over Joel every time for the next. We got one. Chet. We got Joel. We got Jason. We got Ant. Tyrese. We got Tyrese. We yeah. got Jalen. <laughs> you uh, act like anybody a different country can name better people than this list. Oh no, no true, but it's just it don't it don't matter no more. These niggas is good basketball teams, and the U.S. is not. Oh wait. I think Ja, 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 is ja come on, to man. Play, bro. Come on, they man. gonna let Ja, they gonna let Ja out there. Oh, I, I'm all in. They should Ja and Zion should be there right now. So oh, yeah, yeah. Zion for their future. Come but on, bro. I don't think like, the U.S. wants these ball. niggas. Uh, that's the thing. There's zero reason for Ja not to be there. Like they could, they could definitely use Ja. So I wonder if Ja's gonna be back. Because again, it's kind of a Nike or it's a Nike operation and. Ja and Nike not really fucking with. I think they still technically got to work together, but they're not really seeing eye to eye right now. So I don't know how that goes. Zion will be there. Zion's Jordan Brand Duke. He's he'll he'll be there next time. But I don't know, man. It's just the world's in a different place. Like like we're always gonna have the most talent. Although Canada might be coming for us, we'll see. But it's just like. It used to be we had the most talent. We were so much better than everybody else that, like, even though Spain was a really well put together basketball team, like, we still won that game. Only won it by like eight points, but you know, gold medal game against Spain won it because we just had too much talent. If you take away the Kobe Bryant, the LeBron James of the world, and the Stephs and the KDs from the mix, and the world is better, I don't know. Like, we're gonna have the most talent. I don't know if the separation is enough that we're actually gonna win these games. Coming, coming in the future because it's also good. just single game elimination, you know. We good. I'm telling you, bro. We good. They gotta this make year, it. This year the... they fine. This year they fine. No, we good so. every year from here on out. We learned our lesson. Nah, our lesson. the world's just better, man. Think about You're overlooking, it. guys. Last You're time it was guys. close. Last time it was close. Just I think to 08, right? 08 is just we had Kobe. We had LeBron, we had Wade, we had like CP3, we had Dwight Howard, we just stack squad. Spain had the Gasol brothers and some again some Hoopers like some Rudy, uh, Rudy, Rudy Fernandez, some guys that like touched the NBA a little bit, maybe weren't great in there, but were Hoopers. And like it was like eight, ten point game. We thought I like we really I thought I was think oh these niggas might actually lose. Like Kobe really pulled that shit out then. Now imagine like that's a world there are. Now we have Luka Doncic's, we have Jokic's, we have Wimby. Wimby's, we have, and Wimby got a whole bunch of, like, black point guards coming up. Like, that's the thing. Like, there's a lot of black Frenchmen that are going to be in the mix. That's what I was about to say, bro. It's going to be Wimby. It's going to be Wimby and friends, bro. You know, like, all the, bro, France is on the rise right now, bro. That's the thing. They're going to be a team. Like, Koulibaly, Koulibaly, nigga, for the Wizards. Him and Wimby been playing together since this France team that Tony Parker was, like, running a while ago. Like, <laughs> Who is history. that, bro? No. That's, the thing. That's not how bruh. this works, man. No. That's not how this works. You don't no. get to win just because you have the so more, the bit better players. Bro. How much followers he got, It's about bro. the chemistry, bro. What's I mean, his net worth a... looking like compared to everybody else in the NBA? That's not <laughs> it, bro. Like that's why USA with Kobe and also, LeBron, or Kobe and base, LeBron, so like, cool. almost lost to Spain. So you like we got to worry about unless Amp, Amp, Anthony Edwards just becomes that guy, bro. No, but no, bro. It's y'all Kobe, said bro. Wimby and friends is yes. crazy, yes, bro. bro. Yeah. No. Do you know? How many, you want just me to like, list all the people on? You, like, if I list the Spain team, there's a lot of people that you've never heard. It was the Soul Brothers and friends, but they oh, almost geez. beat Team USA because oh, they've been playing together for a long ass time, bro. <laughs> as opposed to a whole bunch of NBA players, you got to bring together. 
with all their egos and shit. <laughs> nah, bro, we learned that lesson, bro. I didn't even know we lost uh, last year, bro. I don't even remember wait, that. They learned the lesson. Like, to your point, they learned the lesson, but, like, this is a one-time card. Like, you don't get to play the I have LeBron, Steph, and KD card anymore. Like, that's this just nice. one year to 40. That's nah, the thing. Bro. There's there's no more. What's the answer now? Everybody's going to be there Look now, here. bro. All cool, the people cool I cool named, bro, going to be there. Respect. Seven, they wasn't making $7 there million dollars next year. He out here. Uh, One million followers each plus. <laughs> it's gonna be a fun one, man. It's gonna be fun. That's the thing. Even with France, the France right, the first, the last draft. I haven't paid attention to the 2024 NBA draft at all, but I'm pretty sure two of the top four picks were French dudes. Yep, they were. They coming. Tell you, bro, they on the rise. The Wimby's friends is coming, bro. Y'all not patriotic enough for this shit, bro. <laughs> That's the problem. I would say even as a parent, I'm concerned. These niggas is not. We should be the most dominant force in basketball in the world, and these niggas probably gonna take an L before I die in the Olympics. Maybe multiple. No, nah. there's no reason for that to happen. Nah. We good. We good. Ant got this from here on out. He not letting have nobody you seen, move. Have you seen Ant? Ant takes pull up jumpers and dribbles a lot. Cause he a goat. Don't work. They don't work on. And I don't work in Europe. Let me show y'all out of country. Let me show y'all out overseas how we do it out here in America. Wow. You know who else could do that? Victor Wimbenyama. No. <laughs> yes, he <laughs> did. Take his kneecaps, bro. Probably does it better, Take too. his kneecaps playing out here with these grown men, bro. Now imagine Victor Wimbenyama in four years. Oh, my God, bro. What's going on, bro? You can't. Okay. We gotta be All right. Let me just, people. before we get off this topic, Victor Wimby and Yama in four years, we're not considering that enough. Like, what, bro? Wimby, you seen Wimby play, bro. Well, who's going to stop Wimby in four years in the NBA? So why would they be able to stop him overseas? What's going what's gonna to stop him? What's going to stop Wimby? Can I tell you? Anthony Edwards in four years mm, is going to be It's not going to be the same as Wimby. He's going to be a dog. He's going to be a good top. Anthony Edwards in four years is going to be a fucking five. dog. He's going to be top five. Yeah. In the league, I oh, yeah. He's yeah. not going to be, gonna be better than – he's probably going to be better than Steph Curry is right now, though. Yeah, exactly. He's not even going to be better than what Steph is right now, old man Steph. So, and we're talking about Wimby in four years. You can't compare nobody to Steph. That's, that's LeBron. Just, All of these that, players we're the talking point. about. That is was, he going to be as good advantage. as KD right now? Our advantage is, he, is we have the best players in the world, and we're going to stop having the best players in the world real soon. He can be better than he could. He could be better than Harden. Is Anthony Edwards going to be better than Kevin Durant right now? Maybe. Yeah, that was a tough. One. I was trying to see. Steph Maybe. felt kind of like a cheat. He has that kind of closer, steal. but no. And I give you that. But again, the point is, I think that's the thing. We're at a real interesting change, right? For the entirety of our lives the best players in the world have been from the united states and it's just changed recently right like it's changed it like i think i think for a lot of people changed with Giannis. Giannis was the first time we had like the best player in the world like as far as like niggas who run the championship like i guess technically dirk but nine people wasn't trying to give it but like we're at a point like it's it's multiple like we're going to list the top five players in the nba at least three of them are not americans <clears throat> We're just I'm just a, saying we're in a different place. And again, to the point with France is like the next the one that seems to be the next generational talent, the next Michael Jordan, the next LeBron James seems to be a French dude. And that French dude, just the last two cl draft classes, like because, again, like Jokic, that dude, Giannis, that dude, their teams kind of suck. Um, Victor, first uh, the first pick in this draft, the sixth pick in this draft and the sixth pick in last draft were all from France. Like, so he's got young and up and coming, like potential superstars next to him too. At least one of those dudes hits as a good role player. It's like, it's scary. It's scary. And that's not, even, we haven't even talked about Canada. Who? The Canadians. Yeah, Canada. Wimby is going to be the GOAT. He is. But, but <laughs> I give you this, I say this, still, Anthony Edwards is better than him, like right now, right now. And with that said, Probably. the best new player that's out is from the U.S. Who? And he's oh, the no. best, I mean, he's best new player that's best. out. I mean, he's not ahead of Shea. Luca, <laughs> Luca, really Shea. Ahead. He's not ahead of either one. They, of them. I love they, Ant. They before him. They are. I mean, they are. That's it's just not much he's before. The newest. He is he? Yeah, I think he might be right. He's the newest. Who's newer than him that's better than him? Victor. 
right now yes. all this, <laughs> i don't know so here's bro, the thing like, yeah. i'll say I, at I, the I, end I say he can be if they gave no, him the time bro, but like but you can't just say he is based off of these stats why and wait not all, okay if we're not talking about stats what are we talking about then just popping off because we're talking about just like, game. like having those insane games no, in I was gonna, anthony was edwards has already. really go bear has but that's really what i'm go. saying you have to say he's better because no because I don't. Of what as a got. basketball was, player no no but he has a better he has a better career than way he had well, a way better career season. just started. he had a way better season that's what i'm saying did he, he hasn't yeah. Wait, numbers wise, stats yeah. wise, way better. No, stats wise, I, mean, I wouldn't say. Maybe, I wouldn't say way better. better but yeah. To, yeah. I, I'll say this. I'll, I'm going to come mm. down the middle here. Um, the numbers aren't way better either way. Not uh, way better. But but no, to your point, like just I think we have to take the fact, like taking it all into account, especially taking the fact, like again, Victor wasn't there to affect the playoffs. Funnily enough, Victor did kind of set Ant up to be successful in the playoffs because if Victor doesn't beat the Nuggets in that game, like with three games left in the season, then none of the playoffs goes the way that it was uh, that it went, which is funny, which again, no knock, but it is funny because that's why Ant probably does get the nod. That being said, like I'm expecting game one, day one of the season, like it's no, that's no longer the better player. Like I'm expecting that, that, <laughs> that is what I'm leading to. Okay. That, that is the ultimate thing of what I'm saying. Yeah, I know yeah. Wimby is better than him. Like I, I'm not saying that Wimby is not better, but we can't say that like, like 2k rating wise, like you would have to give, yeah, no, a, I think that's the perfect way to put it. Higher rating and probably has like. Rating. Right now, I'm Ants a ninety so something first right now. Until probably, that first update, yeah, Ants probably going to be a ninety two nine. I think he was ninety five by the in the at the peak during his playoffs. That's what two K gave him. He's probably like a ninety somewhere between ninety and ninety two. I'm assuming Victor's like somewhere between eighty eight and ninety one right now. Again, that's, as soon as yeah, the first exactly as soon as the first update comes out, as soon as the first roster update comes out. I need to see Wimby and Okay, that's, that's where I'm with you. I'm, I'm with you He's about part. to blow our right minds, now, man. He's about right to blow now, our minds. I'll just, just start talking about shit because right now, the newest fucking person yeah. is Ant. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's going to change. He really gonna, is. I'm leading to. It's going to change right now. Like it's, It is going to change to Wimby, but mm-hmm. it's Ant, bro. No. Y'all got to give Ant his flowers. No. Y'all, not, y'all not respecting Ant. He got. I gave him enough flowers, nigga. They uh, you was giving. They folded, bro. They folded. No, but you can't do that. I mean, I'm not, bro. No, it's not his fault, bro. I know it's not his fault. It's just I feel like we we as NBA fans get a little too excited. I feel like, and we put a lot on this on Anthony Edwards, bro. Like, and then when them last games was happening, bro, it's like, oh man, he's really only like a real only six five. Just I don't know, bro. I started to see like the flaws in his game. I'm sure he's going, he's going, he's going to adjust, bro. But like he has yeah. a lot of work to do. Like I feel like a lot. Yeah, mm-hmm. yes, bro. bro the league is. Good. I mean, to be a like, bro. We have Ja coming he back, has has Zion coming back, Lucas but still here. The funniest, the funniest development of this Team USA for me at least is like, oh. Devin Booker has the best basketball feel of that of that group of the of the Ant Jason Tatum um, Devin Booker of like all like he's the one with the best feel which is why he's getting the minutes Ant's also getting the minutes because he's just he's the best player out of that group obviously but yeah there's some Ant and need to uh, again Booker I, I, I judge that. people too much about how they play with Steph Curry um, but yeah man this is kind of like all right man why why are you out here dribbling 10 times and then pulling into a mid-range jumper from the elbow when you have LeBron James and Steph Curry on the court I feel like we as a team we can get a better shot than this. He has those moments. I need him to chill a little bit, get figure out his game. This is why because he knows no matter what they're winning. First of all, that's the first thing. He knows no matter what they're going to win. Second, he's trying to do this because he knows the ball is going to go to them. So he's just trying to get his in real quick. With knowing and that's, that's, that they're gonna win, no matter what he knows they're gonna win, bro. Was he doing this last year? I wasn't watching. Yes, was he doing yes. This? No, this is no. It's not even bad because again, in the NBA, it's like you kind of need a nigga that can play like that and get that yeah. shot. And it's a big part of the game. It's just oh, this this isn't the time to be doing that. This makes me think that when the playoffs come around and your team needs to get a particular shot, mm-hmm. you're just gonna result to head down. Consider okay, it's never, he's fine. He's very good, but you know, are y'all he's, not? There's room for improvement. Like he can learn from this and not do this anymore in these four years that y'all saying Wimby's going to become. He's going to learn. Oh, yeah. I, I hope he learns from it. But he's going to learn, bro. He's yeah. going to develop and he's going to get better. 
Yep. Wow, he's he is. And it's through shit like this, playing Olympic games with Braun and Eric Oh, Katie, yeah, definitely. Everybody, bro. This is a part of it right here, bro. He learned. He finna take the torch for them oh, yeah. and not finna let nobody win no more, bro. He finna. He got this from here on out. That's he the guy. Shout Hank out to him, guy. bro. But um, Hank's the guy. Like the seven five French dude. Wimby bro. is hella good. He gonna be the goat. Bro. I don't know about Wimby. Win a lot France. of gold medals, bro. Bro, you not, bro. You not understand. Like if Spain was able to beat Kobe and LeBron with just the Gasol brothers, what is gonna stop Wimby, who is better than both Marc Gasol and Paul Gasol? What is gonna stop Wimby? And a whole bunch of professional basketball players who've been playing together since they were kids, beating a Team USA team with a whole bunch of Ooh, I don't it's know, bro. Funny with team with with like they I don't know how they styles are gonna mesh after this know, Steph Lebron just... KD shit is over, bro. Like we were talking Anthony. about Anthony Edwards. <laughs> Who's gonna be the point guard? Ja, ja maybe? Anthony Ja or ja. Tyrese Halliburton. I'm not too happy Tyrese. about either one of those because Tyrese yeah, ain't guarding nice. nobody. Yeah. They low key need ah. hopefully they yeah. somebody somebody <laughs> so the point is there has to be a guard. Yeah. Some, some some guards yeah, gonna think... have to learn how to play some defense. One of those three. Yeah. I, bro, they don't. Who's their big? Like, that's Chet's the, was, the big? That's like, what I was going to say. The biggest years? What are we talking about? Like, Joel's yeah. playing again. Like, Joel's definitely not playing again I mean, in four years. Joel's bro. also he's, sucked. Like, I don't yeah, want this he, nigga. He's been me. bad. He's been AD, nice. AD, I don't no, know. That's, AD. No, that's what I was going to say. The bigger issue, like, talking about the LeBron Steph KD part, the big issue here is that this team has relied very heavily um, for the last, like, decade plus of them, like, on Bam, AD, and Draymond. And I don't know if any of those dudes are going to be. I mean, Draymond's never coming back just because he's old. AD, like, I think we're getting lucky that AD, we're getting a full healthy, like, full AD. Are we getting that four years from now? I don't know. So that's the other thing where it's just, oh, we don't necessarily. Like, that's what happened last year, right? Last year with none, like, no Bam, no AD, no Draymond. And we got tore up at the rim. You know what I mean? It's like, and that was without a Victor Wimbayama being in the mix. It's like, all right, how are we going to defend all these great bigs? I think we're just, right now, we are just relying on them. On Chet, which maybe is enough, but also Chet it's might not, end up being not, one of the best defenders in basketball. Uh, there's also I know there's one guy he's not going to be able to guard. I already know. There's no big man. No, bro. You were starting to think about it. When we are Joel and AD probably not playing in four years, bro. That's hell no. Nah. We don't yeah. even get the Zach Eadie Both injury kid. Zach Eadie kids a Canadian. Don't get hold on, yo. Hold on. We got big men. I'm gonna have Derek Lively out Derek there, bro. Big, man, this is our big issue. Chet, Chet is our answer. Lively oh, out there. Oh, lively, there you go. That's a good one. Oh, and he good. definitely can't guard Wimby, bro. Hold on, Live don't. Hey, Lively gonna be nice, oh, yeah, bro. You hear nice. the names we just said, and then <laughs> bro, you <just> not. Lively, <laughs> it's hilarious because you, bro, you think that there's more. <laughs> Not think, think about they're all, names, like, they're all bro, not American. Like, they're all they're all not American. Like your boy, your boy right Sabonis. Now, like, oh, yeah. Sabonis, low key the closest one because at least he went to college out here. We, we, and Sabonis that and we'll feel bro. no, that's cheating, bro. I don't I mean want he's no not gonna, he's gonna play for Lithuania. Lithuania. He already yeah, plays for play. Lithuania. Yeah, because they gonna probably beat us too. Shit, <laughs> uh, bro, we have no bit. It's Chet, the Great White Hope, but that's not enough. Let me pull out old Google. It's nobody, bro. Jaron Jackson. Ooh, that's so who he we looked, pull that's, up. He, he, he looked who awful last year, bro. He looked so bad in the tournament last year. He looks like oh. he's not built for. That's why I mean, that's why Bam and AD have to come this time. Just Jaron's not built for European basketball. That's the other tough part is that whole Memphis. I don't know if Jaws built for European basketball. I don't know if Zion's built for European basketball. This is a weird team. Just Ja again, the talents there. Ja, Jason Tatum, Devin Booker, Zion Williamson. Um, again, only one big man, but he's a good ass big man. Oh, okay. then that's just not enough. That bro, there's yeah. really only one big. That's crazy. Paolo you know, probably because nobody. we stole him from the Italians. Um uh, Paolo, Cade. None of these are answers that are winning us this thing, man. We literally are like four or five deep, bro. Four, three, we like Cat. four deep. Cass, 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 I was just going to yeah, Cass, Cass, He's not an American. He played for DR. He played for DR last yeah. year. He wanted to play for us. He almost qualified without us last year. He definitely can't guard Wimby. Oh, God. So the other big, I'm going through it. DeAndre, the last two first round picks that were big men uh, DeAndre Ayan, Bahamas, Bahamas. Towns. Not even us, bro. Him and Bob. Yeah, bro. We not, yeah, we definitely yeah, is ugly. Four years from now, we better enjoy this right now. 
We ain't got shit. They don't even got like a bench, bro. Like, what's, bro? Hold on. Hold on. I can think of something, bro. There's no big. That's all on top. Just like, if we're just talking about versus France, bro, like, if we don't have anybody to guard Wimby, like, we're just going to lose, bro. Like, Chet is not going to be able to contain Wimby for a whole game, if at all. Yeah, we're fucked. It's not enough. That's too much on his shoulders, bro. Oh, man. Well, hey. Hold on. Ain't, ain't going to figure it out. <laughs> ain't. That's a question. Yeah. Since we're here, that's a question for next time. All right. If you got Tatum, Zion, Ja, Booker, Ant, who's the one that's not starting? Because you got to start Chet at center. Um, or hopefully AD. Bro, Zion's going to play power forward. Just fuck it. No, I yeah, mean, that part's fine. But who's problem. not? So Tatum, Zion, Ja. Who's not starting? Booker, uh, Ant, who's not starting? Oh. Uh, what do I want to say? Yeah, who you picking to not start? Uh, sorry, bro. Tatum, you got it. okay. It's realistically, I'm gonna say Zion might. No, Zion has to start. Has to start. He has I mean, to. Tatum can play the four. Tatum, yeah. Not as mm. Uh, I want to say Tatum. I ain't gonna lie. That's a Booker can also run points, so you can get Ja out of there if you think that's. I was about yeah. to say, I think I gotta say Ja, bro. Ja, yeah, Ja, ja, ja there. there go. Right? Interesting, interesting decision. Yeah. Interesting decision. Assuming when they let Ja come, um, it's gonna be an interesting one. Look, four years from now, man, it's gonna be fun. I guess even three years from now when we get the FIBA, that's just gonna be fun. Even then, because I feel like we can't go with that little half ass FIBA team like we did last year. We finished, we finished like eighth last year, right? Like, we didn't even like medal. Like, yeah, finish that half ass FIBA team is going to be our real FIBA team. That's, that's going to be what we got, bro. That's, that's what this league is coming to. The Americans are dying out, bro. We about to see this European dominance, bro. We got. Okay, we're going to see how everybody else's team fills out. I'm telling you, Canada, France. I feel like this is this is the bigger issue. Like this is an issue even if we're not talking about how like there's just a lot the rest of the world's getting better at finding black players and developing the talent. But even before that, because like Germany is probably the second best team at this tournament right now. Spain won that shit last year. Like it's just it's coming even without whether your team has black player or a lot of black players or not. But the scary part is just Canada's here and France is just France is coming. And it's like these are going to be teams that are not only like a lot of time, like just it's that another level of time. But on top of that, it's just also I think we're finally going to get I think we're going to get a Af- we're going to get African teams. Like we're just as much as the European teams are like arriving, arriving. We're just at the start of African teams really starting to be competitive in this space. And that's where it gets scary. I mean, you saw like South Sudan played the U.S. close and almost beat Jokic like to get in like yesterday. You know what I mean? So like they said, them niggas don't even be practicing in a gym, bro. What's up with they that? Don't, there's not a they're building the they first don't... gym that this country's Jesus gonna have. Jesus Christ, bro! Hold on. <laughs> so it's like that's the other side of it too. Is like got a lot of African <clears throat> African nations that are that are coming together, and I think we're gonna have some more competition from those spaces. Hey, we got to get right, bro. That's part of our thing in the USA, bro. We supposed to be dominant. We supposed to be mm-hmm. dominant in basketball, bro. Oh. Zero reason for that, bro. We gonna have to do something to make up for that. 